Oscar! Hey, buddy. Hey, Fluffer. I missed you. We got a new car. We bought a new car. Where are the keys, though? Where are the keys? Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. And welcome back to another perfect day here in the beautiful state of Utah. Boys, I have bought a new car. Yes, indeed, I have bought a new car. The car is being loaded on a trailer in Michigan today. The dealer told me it should take anywhere from one to three weeks to arrive here in Utah. That being said, there is not one single person who will be able to guess what this car is. We have a bunch to do in today's video. First and foremost, we gotta pay for this new car. It is not a new car. I need to repeat, this is a used car. We are putting it on an open carrier from Michigan to Salt Lake City. So that should give you a bit of an indication as to the condition of this vehicle. It is not a new V12 Lamborghini. I'm an idiot. I am, I'm truly, I am truly an idiot. When you guys see this car, you're gonna, anyways. Uh, we gotta hop in the Supra, we gotta race up to make some models. We gotta dump the Supra, swap it out for the 430 Challenge car. And that's because we have a bit of a track day today. The four the forecast, however, is showing snow and rain, and although I've never tested the 430 challenge in the snow and rain, I'm pretty sure with quite a bit of uncertainty, actually no, with a lot of certainty, it doesn't do well in the snow. Hmm. Only one way to find out though. Am I right? Am I right? Am I right? I'm going to get a cease and desist from Ferrari if I drive their factory Ferrari race car in the snow. Hmm. Welcome here to make some models. It has officially started raining and in other news, the check engine light's back. The Aventador has a check engine light, the Supra has a check engine light, and, and the Gladiator does. I haven't mentioned that yet, but it, it does as well. I haven't been driving my Supra as often in the winter time because if you remember, we attempted to do donuts in this car and it did not go very well. And here in Utah, like, it can turn from a rainstorm to a snowstorm in the split of a, in the split of, that didn't make sense. Anyways, you know what I mean? It can change very, very quickly. So naturally, we're dropping off the Supra here at make some models to pick up the 430 challenge as you do. It has been way, way too long. Hello, beautiful. I've not driven this car for two weeks, which I realize does not sound like a long period of time, but this car is such an experience. It is so exhilarating to drive. We have a new set of Michelin tires. We got the Pilot Sport Cup 2s. Now, I'm not gonna necessarily say that we should drive the car in the rain because I know that we shouldn't drive it in the rain, but we're gonna drive it in the rain because track day, bro. Also, the Ford GT is inside. We got some big updates on the Ford GT, so we'll get back to the 430 challenge Hopefully when it stops raining. We're here at the back vault of Megs and Models. We got the McLaren 650S. And yes, I still do own my 2005 Ford GT. We have some good news and we kind of sort of have some not so good news. The last time I drove this car, we had a little bit of a spin class and I completely shredded the rear tires. I ordered the new set of Goodyears. They were $2,000, probably the single lamest purchase I've ever made in my entire life. So looking forward into the future as far as the likelihood of the donut vlog being featured on the channel more often with the 4GT, it's not looking so good because the tires were $2,000. Did I mention that the tires were $2,000? Every time I drive the Ferrari, I have to set myself up mentally, physically, and emotionally because it's always an experience, especially in the rain. Unfortunately, I left my headphones at home. That was a mistake and on that bombshell. in the state of Utah, we only have 91 octane. Oh, um, uh, this is awkward. I, I need to remove that, but, but I'm holding this and the camera. I'm gonna guess the fuel tank is at least 15 gallons, hopefully. I guess we'll find out if I overfill, but that's eight and a half right there. I, I think we're gonna be okay, I hope, I really hope. 15.075 gallons. I'm assuming we get like eight miles to the gallon. 
maybe? Fuel now says 76, so I think we're 76% full. I I'm pretty sure. So we probably have like maybe a 20 gallon tank. I don't know if you guys can hear me. I'm pretty sure we have a 20 gallon tank. I'm gonna lose my voice and my hearing in this video. <laughs> I'm trying to drive it in granny mode right now. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. All of my neighbors hate me right away. Okay, I just put it into second gear. It's a little bit more quiet and conservative. I think we're good. Oscar! Hey, Fluff! Hey, bud! Hey! Uh, let's see, I don't have a parking brake, so we'll just dump her right here. Oscar! <laughs> hey, dude! Hey, Fluffer! Hey! Come here! Come here! Yeah, you're a good boy. You're a good boy. Dude, you're wearing a purple sweatshirt. Bro. I have a purple sweatshirt on. This is getting weird. I did not know you were wearing that in my defense. It's a new sweatshirt, it's a new hoodie. What'd you expect? Oh my gosh, I'm getting too old for this. I can't hear. Do I drive the Ferrari in the rain today? Well, like you it's gotta, a little you bit. You gotta do tires, right? I do, and the tires actually handled really, really well. Yep. And They're the new Michelin's, the Sport Cup 2s. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah, you see, exactly, yeah. exactly. Good for you, my friend. <laughs> There's nothing like flexing the Sport Cup 2s on the Burlacker. I'm gonna um, get the track. All right, thanks, bro. Maybe the nicest thing the Burlacker has ever done. He got me a vanilla Coke, my guy. Link in the description below. That's all you need. You get me a vanilla Coke, I'll give you a link whenever you need it. Anyway, so where are we headed? To the track. In the rain, in the Ferrari. There's an outside chance we might crash. There's another outside chance it might start snowing, and that's a bad day, but today's a good day. Also, I have been shaking this so much, it's going to explode. It's tasty and refreshing. This is probably the most dangerous vlog we've ever had. We're with Bilko and Burlacker in Mustangs in the rain. <sighs> Wish me luck in the comments below. This is gonna be scary. <laughs> go, 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 okay. Wait, 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 chill. This is proper positioning right here. The Mustangs are in front of us. That means they can't hit us. I don't know if you can hear me. It's so loud. We have some very bad news. It's emotional. We have reached the emotional part of the vlog. I have never seen Burlacker. He looks so sad. Why it's going to be okay. So it's not that big of a deal. But uh, the racetrack, we thought was going to be dry. Uh, our, re our reconnaissance just told us that it's actually covered in snow. And the Ferrari, are you kidding me? You had to make a short man joke in this moment in time? Trying to get He's 6'6". Six, six. It's not that big of a deal. Anyways, the racetrack is covered in snow. So we're going to take the Ferrari home, we're going to grab the Focus, and we're going to meet the Mustangs out at the track, assuming they don't crash on the way to the track. I probably should grab the Jeep. Or the tow truck! I should get the tow truck! When we need it, you don't have it. I know. Also, shout out to Clayton Face Summit Auto Lab. They killed the rap on Will's Mustang. Bilko, we will see you out at the track. Is this thing Ford wins by default? I'm getting the Ford. I'm getting the Focus RS. Yeah. Well, Ferrari doesn't win today. Uh, Ferrari... I was just gonna say something negative about Ferrari, but they send cease and desist letters, so yeah, we're, just, we're, we're headed home. Unfortunately, we're gonna have to dump the Ferrari here, and we're gonna hop in the Focus RS. Oh, I can't reach, I cannot reach. All right, we're good. I can't hear anything. Uh, Chuck. We need the chuck. Always have the chuck. The 430 challenge doesn't have an e-brake, so you gotta chuck it up. Yes, because, well, I'd, I'd rather have it roll that way than into Nick's house, I think. Oh, I'm so disappointed. Today was gonna be the first time I was gonna track the 430 challenge, but obviously there is a snow apocalypse about to descend on Utah, and we just got word that the track is covered in snow, so I guess, uh, I guess it just wasn't meant to be. You're not driving, bud. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Yeah. I probably could have driven the Ferrari in the snow, but it would have been a bad idea. So unfortunately, we got the Focus. I mean, I love the, I love my Focus RS. 
and I know Oscar hates it. Don't worry, bud. You got a Rolls Royce coming soon. Whoa, I'm just kidding. I did not buy a Rolls Royce. I know, I know. It's a hard life as a fluff. It's a hard life. I should have brought the Ferrari. I should have done it. We could have done donuts right here. Oh, bro, slow down. Slow, slow. On your mark, get set, go. Oh, buddy. That is called overconfidence right there. We got a lot of slush. Oh, the man. last thing I need to do is put this in the thicket. Also, I can smell the clutch so bad. Yeah. That's, just, oh, that's, that's not a good smell. That's not what we want. Oh, jeez. That's some G right there. Okay, this is the... Whoa, this is this it. Is it. Oh, my gosh. This oh my is gosh. it. This is actually scary. We're good, we're good, we're good. Full send, full send, full send. No, oh, not full send. Full send. Oh, my gosh. Gosh. I'm nauseous from the, the driving and the smell. The smell. You left your clutch I know. at the start. Line, I know. Bro. That was a mistake, Jeez. but it sounded good. And it was a good launch. It felt strong. I need some fresh air. I smashed it. I smashed it. I smashed it. Sorry. Sorry, Nick. Nick, uh, I'm sorry, brother. Yeah, dude. 131. So. <laughs> yes! What did I say? That's what I said. You did. That's what I said. Lambo Jesus in his Mercy Lago LP640 did 124 in the dry. Alex, I love you if you're watching today's video. That was not meant to be. Well, that's a good we time. We like you too, Alex. That's a good time. That's a great time. In the summer, we don't barely get that with some cars. So I think in the summer, this car might be able to set the track record. I know that sounds crazy. And not with it's me great. driving, but with like Ken Block driving, I think it could. <laughs> that I agree with. That. that is the smell of some fresh clutch. Yeah. Probably gonna have to replace that soon, but I am selling the car. So as long as the prospective owner doesn't know about that, I think we're good. Yeah, we're good. It's never good when there's a crowd gathering around a Mustang because you just never know what they're up to. What is going on? What is this? Well, it's Jerry. Jerry. what is this? Are you kidding me? We have smoke bombs. Ta the, the tape's not gonna hold, bro. No, it won't. This is an example when you get two Mustang drivers together in the same region. It, crazy ideas like this come together. I, I, I don't know what to expect. Two, three. Oh, snap, my tape rip. My tape rip. James is I told right. you. James is right. I can't Just go. Up. Go. What are you doing? Go, go, go. to Burlacker, his was the only smoke bomb that survived. You're staying on? <laughs> what? Dude, shout out, link below, link below. Boys, you go subscribe to Burlacker and you do it right now, <laughs> right you. now. Thank you, thank you. That was actually cool, Will, that, that was, was sick. Right that was sick. Us. Shout out to Will too, also link below. What? You heard uh -oh. me. Uh -oh. No, I didn't, say focus. it again, say I, it again. I will beat that focus someday. Ah, uh, shout out to Blinker Fluid. Guys, thank you so much hey, you. for the access to the track. I'll be back next week with the 430 challenge and we're gonna set a track record. Yes, yes we are, yes we are. Awesome, thank you guys. I probably could have taken the 430 challenge out to the track, but it probably would have been a bad idea. Wait, whoa, bro! Yo! Are you kidding me? I'm telling you, he's trying to hit me. He's trying to end the YouTube career. Sounds good. Chill, 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 chill. Jeez, chill. I probably could have taken the Ferrari. I probably could have, but I didn't. But maybe I should have. It was a good thing you didn't. I feel like we're missing cars. The Ford GT, the Supra, and there's another car. Oh, I just, I just bought a car. The Jeep's there. The Jeep. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The other car that you just bought. I just bought a car. You bought a car too. We both, we Whoa. both just bought cars. I haven't even announced it on my channel yet. Oh. No, it's okay. You can, you know. You can. I can get the exclusive? Yeah, it's all yours. Yes. Yes. That is going to effectively end today's video, but the 430 challenge, we're gonna start wrapping this car on February the 3rd, and it will not be purple. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, like squad, be sure to smash that like button. But just like that, this vlog is over.